Now in Mount Juliet, crews have been working around the clock to plow and clear the roads, but Mount Juliet police say every road still has some snow uh -huh. and some ice on it. Secondary and neighborhood roads, those are the most dangerous. So what does that mean for people who've been stuck at home for days now? News 2's Adam Mincer is in Mount Juliet with more. As we look towards the third day of this winter weather, restlessness is starting to settle in. Mount Juliet police say that many of the main roads and highways have been plowed, but so many of these secondary streets have not yet. Behind me, you can see Central Pike. There is still a significant amount of snow on the ground, and the bridges in particular are slick. We've been seeing people struggle to get up and down throughout the day, but with this restlessness comes the need for people to get out to get more supplies and get to work. I didn't make no money Monday, Tuesday, so my next week check gonna be a nothing burger. So what am I supposed to do? With his car unable to manage the icy roads, Terry worries once the warehouse he works at in Mount Juliet opens up again, he'll be stuck here. Look at this right here. Like, I don't get it. Or like, y'all do the main roads. What about the back roads? Mount Juliet police say they're aware secondary roads aren't clear yet and urge people to be cautious. Your neighborhood roads are going to be the worst now because they don't get a lot of traffic and the snow plows don't make it on those deep neighborhood streets. But while understanding why the roads around him aren't a priority, Terry says people like him are being left behind, walking around to get supplies from nearby gas stations with no promises of getting any compensation for days he isn't working. If they know for a fact that we can't go to work, whoever it is should be like, I'm gonna pay everybody. PTO, pay time off. I need that. I would love that PTO. He says some of his friends have bosses wanting them to get to work, leaving people wondering, is the guarantee of a full paycheck worth the risk of being another car stuck in the snow? In Wednesday, Mount Juliet City offices will be closed, as will police administrative offices in Wilson County schools. Reporting in Mount Juliet, Adam Mincer, News 2.